Lead the way. A proactive approach to guided assistance. Meet James. James recently traveled on board an aircraft to a different city to attend a family reunion and is getting ready to return home. However, James is visually impaired and sometimes needs assistance navigating unfamiliar places. James was not familiar with his departure airport and needed guidance navigating to his departure gate. Unfortunately, James did not receive the assistance he needed and spent a lot of his time going in the wrong direction. James missed his flight home and had to wait for another flight. Getting to the departure gate can be very challenging regardless of who you are or how many times you have traveled. As such, individuals needing assistance rely on your expertise to troubleshoot certain issues or help get them to where they need to be in a timely fashion. That's why, when approached by someone requiring special assistance or guidance, do your best to lead the way. That is, listen to their concerns and or requests. Engage with them in an attentive and respectful manner. Assist with their request. Accompany them to their next or final point and answer any questions they may have and double check to make sure they are where they need to be, have what they need, or are with someone who can continue to lead the way. Let's see what this looks like with another person. Meet Jerry. Jerry recently traveled to a different city on board an aircraft for a work-related project. Unfortunately, Jerry was involved in an accident and sustained injuries to her legs. Now, Jerry is getting ready to return home and will need assistance getting to her departure gate. Upon arriving at the airport, Jerry proceeded to the check-in counter. The ticket agent listened to Jerry express her concerns regarding boarding the airplane. She then continued to engage with Jerry in an attentive and respectful manner by acknowledging her concerns and offering to assist. Jerry's mood improved immediately. The ticket agent assisted Jerry by arranging for a wheelchair assistant and boarding assistance. Shortly after issuing Jerry her boarding documents, the ticket agent double-checked to see if Jerry had any additional concerns or questions. Jerry stated she did not need any additional assistance and proceeded to the security gate with her wheelchair assistant Brian, who continued to lead the way. First. Brian and the airport security screener listened to Jerry's questions and concerns regarding passing through the metal detectors while in her chair. They engaged with her in a friendly manner by acknowledging her concerns and answered her question by assuring her she can pass through the security check while seated in her chair. Jerry passed through security successfully and was well on her way to reaching her departure gate on time. Before departing, Brian double-checked to see if Jerry had any additional questions. Jerry stated she did not have any additional questions and they proceeded to the departure gate. Jerry reached her departure gate on time where the gate agent and flight attendant continued to lead the way. The gate agent listened to Jerry reiterate her concerns. She continued to engage with her in a friendly manner and confirmed the boarding assistance arranged by the ticket agent. Jerry proceeded to the aircraft, where the flight attendant accompanied her to her seat. Once in her seat, the flight attendant double-checked to see if Jerry had any questions or concerns. Jerry stated she did not need any additional assistance for the moment and was ready to go home. Let's recap what happened here. First, the airline and airport personnel listened to Jerry's concerns and questions. Second. They engaged with Jerry in an attentive, respectful, and friendly manner, and thus put her at ease. Third, the ticket agent assisted with arranging for a wheelchair assistant and boarding assistance. The wheelchair assistant and security screener answered Jerry's question, and the flight attendant accompanied Jerry to her seat. And last, they each double-checked to see if she needed any additional assistance or had any more questions. Jerry's journey started off rough. However, she received the assistance she needed and was able to return home. All thanks to the airline and security personnel who chose to lead the way.